let's discuss the American elm for a little while. According to AI, uh, the conservation status of the tree shows it as being endangered. However, the scientific classification shows it uh, out of the at-risk category, but below the secured category. So, uh, I mean, it's, it's not, you know, as prevalent as it used to be, but they are out there. So this particular tree, even though it was a healthy tree, despite the, the rot in the middle, um, it was going to come down. Uh, I got it from work. It was being cleared for a new uh, um, simulated hospital that is going up for the community college that I work for. And so this one and several smaller uh, elms that were on site were also taken down because the whole area was clear cut for this new building. So the elm is a fairly hardy tree that can take harsh conditions and it also can thrive in urban conditions. That's why it was very popular in the late 19th and tw early 20th centuries as being a street tree because it could take that urban setting. Of course that is until Dutch elm disease came around. It is spread by the elm bark beetle uh, and it is a fungus and it was brought to the United States from Asia and also spread to Europe and New Zealand. Dutch elm disease is the reason why there are many, many, many cities that have elm streets in them and nary an elm to be found anywhere. Watching this video, it's little wonder I needed shoulder surgery.